Borsio? Borsio? Christ Almighty! Trying working for you for the living. They talk and talk and talk and Jesus Christ will he ever shut up? Titanic self-absorption of the man. You stand there trying to look so deep and you want nothing. You're so narcissistic and bully with your grandiose self-importance and arias and lectures. And let's look at the fucking camera some of the few weeks. Let's not fucking painting. Let's just look. <laughs> The pretension. Jesus Christ, the pretension. I can imagine any other painting in the history of art ever tried so hard to be significant. You know, not everything has to be so goddamn important all the time. Not every painting has to rip your guts out and expose your soul. Sometimes you just want the fucking still life, or landscape, or soup camp, or comic book. <laughs> Which you might learn if you ever actually left your goddamn hermetically sealed submarine here with the all windows closed and no natural light. Because natural light isn't good enough for you. And then, nothing is ever good enough for you. Not even the people will buy your pictures. Museums are nothing but mausoleums. Galleries are nothing but pencil windows. And art collectors are nothing but shallow social climbers. So who is good enough to own your art? Anyone? Or maybe the real question is, who is good enough to even see your art? <laughs> is it possible? Is no one is worthy to see your paintings? That's it, isn't it? We all have to be weighed in a balance and have to be found wanting. You say you spend your whole life looking for real human beings, people who can look at the pictures with the compassion. But in your heart, you no longer believe that those people exist. So you lose fate, so you lose hope, so black swallows red. My friend, I don't think you recognize that you're human. If you stand right in front of me, 